Real estate for sale, home buyer's blog, questions to ask your moving company before you sign the contract. Realtor and area specialist Mike and Jennifer Wrigley here bringing you the latest real estate information. Thanks for joining us. Let's talk about the seven questions you should ask your movers before you sign that contract. When choosing movers, it's important to have them come to your home to give you a visual estimate so they can see exactly what you need moved. When they're in your home, it's also important to ask them questions about themselves and the moving company. Here are some, some questions to ask him and the answers that you should expect. Number one is how long has the company been around? A bad moving company won't stay in business very long, so if it's been around for a decade or more, that's a good sign. Also ask how many moves do they do a year? The more they do of something, the better the odds are that they're pretty good at it. Number two is how do they price their moves? This is a good test of their knowledge of the moving industry and of their customer service skills. You want someone who explains the often confusing terminology in the, in the moving industry and not someone who rushes through their explanations or seems to be using insider language in an effort to confuse you. If you don't understand something, ask. Number three, how long have they been giving estimates? Experience counts for a lot. It's not easy tallying up the cost for moving quotes, so someone who's relatively new at it or new in the moving industry should be a bit of a concern, particularly if they have problems answering your, your other questions. Number four, what is my delivery schedule? The worst trait in a mover is overpromising, either on price or when you can expect to get your things. You will receive your delivery within a particular time frame, so you should be uh, very wary of any moving company that that, that gives you an, an exact date for your, your items to arrive. There are just too many things that could go wrong to file those dates. There's more information on moving company delivery in uh, Windows. Does the mover do any repeat work for businesses in the area? Most movers have the, the usual canned references. Avoid these. Ask instead if the moving company does repeat work for any area businesses. Businesses won't put up with shoddy treatment. So if they use the same mover time and time again, that's a great sign. Number six is, are there any extra charges I could face? In particular, ask whether you'll pay for packing materials. A commonly heard complaint is that the movie company overcharged for packing materials that the customer didn't know about. And, and didn't, uh, don't ask about hidden costs. No moving company will, will admit to the cost being hidden. Instead, they'll want to say they're in the contract. So ask to see all of the charges in the contract instead. Don't ask for hidden costs. Ask to see what's in the contract. And number seven, how will they handle a challenging or expensive item? This is another test of the moving consultant's knowledge, as well as the test of how well you can expect to be treated. A thoughtful and complete answer is a good sign that you'll be treated thoughtfully during your move. So we hope this helps, and if you need finding that perfect place to call home, call us today at 916-378-4671 for a free, no-obligation consultation, or log on to www.wrigleyrealtygroup.com to start your online search today. Call us today, you'll be glad you did, and we'll look forward to hearing from you. Thanks.